a while. I'm in my PJs. Well, actually, I'm in half not a PJ, half a PJ, but it's actually getting my whole body. So, this is what I look like today. All right. I'm here, and I wanted to do a little DIY face mask. I actually already um, mixed up everything in here. Looks like... Mm -hmm baby food mm, yummy so you get a half an avocado a full egg and a teaspoon of I'm like a teaspoon or teaspoon it has a S. sir please stop barking shit my family drama hold on and I can't even ah! can we change uh, lighting up in this bitch Oh, yeah, we can. Let's go with that. Let's go with that. Okay, so I'm back. I'm so sorry about that. So, oh, yeah, do you guys like my nails? I did myself. I didn't do that good, but they're like my second try. It's this $11 uh, nail dip kit from Walmart. Better I'll show you a video, but I know I don't want to. I don't need hate right now, so let me practice. Let me do me, and then I'll show you guys. But I'm actually, like, pretty impressed with my... $10 skills right here. Okay, so what we're doing is I have my dry hair because they say it's oil-based mask. So they say when your hair is wet, it'll kind of repel all the natural healing properties. And and uh, actually, here's a before picture of my hair. Right? Kind of dry. And it, I braided it for like three days and then it got straight and then I braided the top of it again. So it's kind of like a lot's going on with it. But I got really dry hair toward the end, and I want my hair to be past my booty. Uh, so right here, everyone thinks it's long, but I want it like, oh, like, oh, like right there. Like right there. That's my goal right there. Okay? That's it. So we're coming back, and I'm not using any lighting right now or anything. I'm just using, so you can see my beautiful, my beautiful bags of not sleeping. <laughs> um, so I'm just using my, uh, Light in my bathroom. I have my, I have my ring light, but there's no way I can set it up normally. So, fuck it. All right, we don't do this. We don't do this. I'm honestly, I don't want to get my. I don't want to make a mess. Parts are the ends, so somehow I'm gonna get it in that situation. Okay. So I've mixed it already. Let's do it. This messed up towel is really bothering me. I think what I'm gonna do is like maybe like take the bowl and like hmm. see what that does. Well, that wasn't really. Hmm. I shouldn't have done that. Okay. Well, I really want to start at the ends because that's like kind of ew. Don't throw up. Don't throw up. Don't throw up. It feels like throw. I want to start at the ends because that's where like all the dryness is at, as you can see. So I'm just gonna kind of. Oh, this smells like not, it doesn't smell, but like it feels like throw up and it kind of smells like it. So. Sorry if you guys hear my dogs barking. So we're supposed to put this in our hairs. So I'm going to start, actually this is kind of a smart way to do it. Because then you can kind of like do a unicorn, a unicorn tail or I mean a horse tail with your hair. Ew. I probably shouldn't use the Liga that I'm going to use, like leave it around my wrist, but whatever. All right, we're getting it. It's getting together. And then I'm going to kind of pretty much like crunch it together. Ugh. Good Lord. Okay, now I'm going to try to work my way. Oh my God. I'm trying not to throw up. Ugh. Ugh. Just the way uh, I'm a vomit. Oh, this is hard. Okay. You got this, Nisa. And if you guys got little chunks of like avocado, just like get it in there. It's gonna kinda let me dip that in there like so. sure it's on there yep yep shove the whole all the hair 
Ooh, I should try to like leave this up there. <laughs> what if I can like just leave it? The new style, quarantine hairstyle 2020. <laughs> You're welcome. Oh, I almost dropped it. A little bun and you can see the kind of bits and pieces of the avocado in there. It feels, you know, like some something might happen. I have a 20 minute timer, we're gonna use that. And then I'm gonna, after these 20 minutes, I'm gonna wash it out and we're gonna see how it turns out. So I took my shower and I washed everything out and I just washed my hair with my normal shampoo, suave uh, almond butter, the shampoo and conditioner with that and wow, like, this, my hair feels so soft. Like I can run my whole entire, my, just my fingers through my hair with no stops. It's so amazing. It feels so good. And here is an after picture of it. Like, that's freaking Sick, I keep looking down with the things up here. Wow, and normally even when I buy like hair masks, even the ends of my hair are normally like still a little frayed. And I mean, they're still a little dry because I mean, uh, I know I need to cut my hair a little bit more often. I was so scared about cutting off length, but I've been reading how to grow my hair and they're like, actually you need to be cutting your hair like every four, every four weeks. So I'm like, okay, so I'll just start trimming my hair more often. And then that like, that end of broom feeling like, I'm gonna, it's gonna go away, but I definitely recommend this mask. It's a, just a half an avocado, an egg, and a table teaspoon of oil. Like not even the whole avocado. And I didn't even use the full half, I kinda used like a third of a half. Or no, a, four, a third, like 75% of a half. So, but I definitely like recommend, and now I need to go braid my hair. And another hair tip for all you ladies that are trying to grow your hair out, please don't spend a lot of money, please, please, please don't spend a lot of money on product or sugar bear hair or, or all those things. All you need is biotin. All I take is biotin. I wash my hair and put a lot of, I'm starting to do more DIY masks because, you know, there's still sometimes like in the hair masks that you buy in a pouch and stuff, there's still chemicals. So I've been really exploring, especially during all this quarantine and all this time off, I've been really exploring things I can do on my own and how to help my hair. And I really want it to get a little bit thicker because I feel like the front of my hair is a little on the thin side because when I do, I used to do ballet a lot, so I'd pull my hair back in buns. So I kind of want this to like get thicker. So I'm working on having healthier hair and thicker hair. So I know it, it those kind of go hand in hand. So I think it's going to work out, but I really enjoy this. As you can see, I'm back in my PJs. So I'm going to go ahead and edit this video probably and post it for you guys soon. But this is like, yes, A1 recommend. And th th I'm not even using lighting. This is still my, like just my bathroom light. And wow, like it, I wish you guys could feel this right now. It's so soft. I'm gonna have a hard time breaking it. Well, comment below how you guys think I did. Um, let me know any other masks you guys may have or any tips and tricks for thickening your hair. If any of you girls have kind of done that for yourself. I don't like to buy product and I don't like to buy like expensive things or subscriptions that I know I'm gonna have to be paying for in the long run because I don't need to. You really don't need to do that. So as you can see, I have really long hair and I haven't done sugar bear or anything like that so thank you guys so much for watching I hope you guys enjoyed and keep taking care of yourself self-care is important and please please always remember always remember if you want it go get it and you can always do anything yourself definitely